Morning folks, Kevin Worthing Vapor back here again for another hardware review. And I've got a little pod for you this morning. It's the Nord from Smog. Right, that's okay. Anyway, watch this. I'll be back with you guys in just a tick. Right, so here's the box for the Smock Nord kit. Nice little thing, it really is. I'll show you in a minute. But anyway, you've got a picture of the uh, device on the front there. You've got all the usual bits as well there. Tell me about it. This has got a 3mm capacity for liquid. There's there's the, uh, the little thing. We'll put that there for just a tick. You get inside the box, you get one of these verify... Veri verification cards things yeah and a warranty on the opposite side you also get your smock nord user manual which this one is all in english but i've noticed with the tpd version they've got a more co comprehensive manual in different languages that's that's what you get with the tpd version and as i say it's uh, it's all in different uh, different languages <coughs> just a quick look this is the spare pod or a spare pod um it's not a bad little thing actually you've got uh, a heavy duty plastic on the top there which feels rather you know uh, durable actually as opposed to this uh, this bottom part clear part where your your coil sits uh, you've got a little tab there that you pull out or a bung that you pull out and you can fill up down through there that's where your coil sits yeah let me uh talking about coils you get two coils with the unit one is a, a 0.6 and the other one is a mouth to lung 1.4 so that's what the coils look like yeah and the 0.6 is uh, mesh where the I believe that the uh, the 1.4 is round wire Anyway, right, let's put that to one side. Right, this, that's, that's how your coil goes in. Put it in so that uh, you've got the uh, nail spaces so you can pull it out again. I think that's the way it goes round. Yeah, there you go. Goes in like so. Okay, that's, uh, and of course you get your usual micro USB cable. And believe me, this thing is pathetic it's useless it really is I mean I on my desktop here I can't put that into the unit and vape on it you know to charge it and and vape on it at the same time although the unit itself is a pass-through you can vape on it if you've got a longer cable um, so uh, this is but well, it's a bit pathetic really right let's uh, take a look at the unit itself there's a tank full up there i've uh, got the 0. Point, uh, sorry i've got the 1.4 coil in there or the or rather the wife has got the 1.4 coil in there for mouth to lung put that there uh, down inside there you've got your contact points they are spring loaded um, there's nothing really too much to this thing um, the uh, the body is a zinc alloy um, yeah this gold one is very it picks up the fingerprints a hell of a lot <laughs> uh, the pattern on the front there is like a honeycomb pattern you've got a fire button for advertising you've got smock you've got nord your ce mark and your wheelie bin uh, designed by smock if you can see that there yeah right okay right now it's a simple matter of five on five off i've just turned it off one two three four five turn it on and it flashes white uh, to check your battery state one two and it'll flash up whatever your battery level is this has been fully charged you've got amber and you've got red when it needs charging what I do when I put this into the unit is um, you do get a little bit of seepage from the bottom of that coil there that I have noticed with this in the last few weeks. But uh, what I do when I put this into the uh, into the unit or into the pod, I make sure that, that tab is particularly one side. I mean, you might prefer that side, but I prefer to keep it that side. And when you put the pod in, it does flash. Okay, there you 
There you go. Right, well, there's nothing to this little thing. Let's uh, let's go back up top, and uh, I'll I'll give you give it give it a two, talk about it, and you can see what the uh, the 0 0.6 is like as well, because I've got that in another unit. Okay, right. See you in a tick, folks. Okay, welcome back up. We've been talking about this little Nord pod kit or pod system from Smock. Do you know, I quite like it. I, I, it's unusual for me because I... Yeah, I give pod systems their fair go, their fair shake. But to be quite honest, I'm not a pod person. Yeah? <laughs> yeah, right. Um, yeah, no, I, I don't get on very well with pods. I mean, there was only one pod that I actually got on with, and that was the Breeze 2 from Aspire. But then the battery on that was absolute crap. It really was absolute crap. Anyway, as I said earlier on, I've got, I've got two of these. Well, this one belongs to the missus, and this one I actually went out and I bought myself. Uh, this one's got the 0 0.6 ohm coil in it, and this one's got the 1 1.4 ohm coil in it. Let's give the 1.4 coil a blast, and I've got in there a double, double drip salt nick, uh, super berry sherbet. Yeah, it's all right. It's okay. Can't vape it with the uh, um, 0 0.6, but uh, that's. There you go. Anyway, if I sound funny or I start coughing, I've just got over uh, uh, laryngitis and bronchitis. So <laughs> there you go. Anyway, let's uh, let's give the uh, the one point four a, a blast. Vapor's a little bit disappointing for me personally, uh, but the flavour the flavour is top notch. It really is, and you get that nice. <coughs> little uh, uh, throat kick at the back of your throat which is great yeah right not my favorite vape um i'm more of a subomer uh than a mouth to lung vapor these days but uh well there you go anyway let's uh let's bring over this one which is the black one um and i've got the as i said i've got 0.6 ohm coil in there and i've got Double drip, coil source, crystal mist in there, which is like a, a menthly, uh, fruity concoction. Oh, oh, yeah, that is much more me. Much, much more me. <laughs> right, so what can I tell you about this, these little things? The actual size of the device is 94 millimeters from top to tail including the pod width of it across the uh the, the front there is 30 millimeters and the depth of it across the side is 18 millimeters so it, it i mean it, it it sort of hides in your hand it is quite a nice little thing actually i don't mind it i, I really don't it's a real true pocket mod yeah 1100 mile battery on there which yeah that's that's great uh and that's that's great i mean with the 0 0.6 i can get a good four hours from it with the 1.4 in there it goes all day it really does i mean you get a decent eight hours from it the output on um on on, on it is uh 10 to 15 watts according to smock it's fair enough i mean for what it is for the battery capacity and for what it is it's great it's great when i was down at the table i said that the the pod system on this one is three mil the tpd version which is this one is uh is two mil that's all, that's all right anyway i mean you you've got various different colors they come in black gold green red rainbow or uh, a, a black and white yeah i know mean, they're cheap too they are a cheap a cheap little uh, little kit and i'll tell you what for what they're asking for it i think i might go and get another one actually uh, <laughs> uh, let's have a look here and see what i've uh yes that was something i was going to uh show you down at the table but i never actually got to do it I don't know if you can see that on there, but Smock have now started to include um, an anti-counterfeit sticker on their boxes. That's 
they're, they're new ones. I uh, thought I'd mention it, like, you know. Yeah, the TPD one has got it on there as well. Incidentally, that's the standard pack, yeah. And that's what the pack looks like over here in the UK. The flavour from that is really, really crisp. It's, it's really, really nice. The flavour from this one is equally as good. I just love the plume of vapour that I get from it. <laughs> the pod is held in. It's just it's a it's a pushing pod. Yeah, uh, there's no uh, no no movement there to it whatsoever. It's uh, it yeah, it's fine. I mean, there's no wobbling or anything like that to it at all. In fact, it is quite difficult to actually get that out of there. But <laughs> there you go. There isn't really that much more that I can tell you about this. It's simple. It is a, a, a decent little pod system. When I picked that TPD one up, I picked up a packet of 0 0.6 ohm coils with it as well. They are a little expensive for a five pack. But, well, you know, I mean, I, I've, I've had this, uh, had this going now, this, this black one going for nearly three weeks, I think, and um, the coil's still good, it's still fine. Wonderful. Absolutely wonderful. <laughs> pros and cons. Let's do the pros and cons on it. It's well designed. The unit is well designed. I mean, this one, like the gold one, has got the honeycomb pattern on it. It is. It, it's been rounded off at the sides. It's nice to hold. It's very, very comfortable in the hand. Um, you get a good va uh, flavour production, whichever coil that you use with this. I, as I say, I personally prefer the 0.6. Uh, but the uh, the uh, uh, the one point four is brilliant. Uh, uh, the 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 intensity of the uh, the flavour production from this one, even though you don't get a lot of vapour from it, is very very good. Battery life for mouth to lung, it's great. For the uh, well, it's still very very good for um, the zero point six as well, direct to lung. Um, for about four hours, that's great, you know. Um, I like the idea that Smock have included two coils to test out with this. I really do like the idea of that. It gives you as a consumer the chance to try both of them and decide which one you want to use for yourself, sort of thing, you know. The airflow is acceptable on both of them. Um, I would have preferred it to be, uh, for the uh, uh, the direct lung one, I would have preferred it to have been just that little bit more wide, but then you can't have everything. This is a pod system and it's supposed to be um, foolproof, yeah? <laughs> the price of the kit is very cheap, it really is. The coils, not quite so much, but uh, there you go. Uh, cons. The micro US B cable and I'll put it away now but uh, it was it's it's pathetic I mean if you've got a tall desktop system like mine and your USB ports are on the top of the unit you can't put on it while you're charging it not with that little cable I think it's a bit pathetic so I've been I've been actually I've been using one of these there you go it's plugged in all the time anyway but uh, it's an Inikin one <laughs> Coil material, that was something else that I was going to say to you guys. Um, the coil material has not been mentioned in any of the uh, in the pack or online. Come on, Smoke, we really want to know what these are made of, sort of thing, you know. I I haven't had any ver adverse reaction with them, so I can only assume that they're cancelled or stainless steel. Well, that's just about it. Am I going to buy Would I buy this? Yeah, Blitchard. Bottom dollar, I would. Cool, not half. Um, in fact, as I said just now, I, I think I might even go out and get a, a, another one um, for myself personally. You know, I mean, the uh, as I said, the wife pinched the gold one, so this one's got to go back to her. I'm just using it for this review. Uh, so, yeah. 
she does like her her salt nick i tell you <laughs> and she likes the because it's like a uh, it's not quite as tight as a, a a cigarette but it is fairly tight and it's it's certainly certainly too tight for me anyway this has been Kevin from Whirling Vapor. Thank you so much for listening to my warblings on this morning and putting up with uh, a little bit of croakiness and, and whatnot. I should, hopefully, I'll be back to normal. Hopefully, pretty shortly. <laughs> anyway, um, I've got a review for this, actually, on EC Click. The, uh, the address is there, and it will also be down underneath um, my video in the written part underneath this on youtube anyway what can i more i can't say anymore anyway as i said thanks very much for listening to my warbling on and i'll catch you lot on the next one cheers for now let's give you two out because you know i'm all about that vape about that vape air bubbles i'm all about that vape about that vape air bubbles i'm all about that vape about that